a heavy girder overbridge. Now we, as you would have seen, we did this as a team. So we used this 32 ton crane to do it. And this is essentially used to go over any weak spots in roads and culverts. Today we have been doing slinging and signalling in the morning and the main objective of that was to make sure that we had all of our hand signals um, down to a T in terms of how we're communicating with the crane operator and that they essentially do exactly what we need them to do on the ground. Um, the other objective really was to make sure that we're working well as a team so we're using very heavy items and it's important that everyone communicates really clearly in terms of what they want to do and um, making the final outcome obviously as successful as possible. I would say the negative of today was the fact that we had a test. So the test encompassed uh, essentially the last four days and uh, it meant a lot of information that we had to try and uh, recollect. Um, and uh, although it's not many questions, you have to get, I think, over 57%. And a few people were a little bit worried about it, um, but I think most people passed today. So that was really good. And that's the end of our testing now, I believe. So that means that it's a downhill slope till the end of the course. In terms of a rating of today, I would give today a strong seven out of 10. So really enjoyed using uh, different signaling with the crane. These are things that I've seen in terms of construction sites, but never really had an opportunity to do myself uh, with the jib going up and down and you know having to move the crane uh, arm from, from left to right and to essentially allow it to do whatever task you need to do on the ground. So that was really, really enjoyable.